Hi, this is Deborah at the Labyrinth, and we're going to do a card of the day for the week, Monday for Monday through Friday. So let's see what we've got this week. Hopefully it'll be good. Hopefully. Yay. Okay, this is for Monday, and this is the Empress card. And this is a card of prosperity and growth on all levels, physical, mental, emotional, and spiritual. It's a card of... Uh, like I said, growth in all areas, but it's also a card of motherhood. So uh, whatever's going on in your life, uh, look at Monday and see, okay, things are growing in my life. It could be with your job. It could be with your family. It could be physically, as in pregnancy, or having something come into your life that is giving it an uptick, you know, like, oh, I have arrived. So this is a very positive card, the prosperity and growth for Monday. Now, for Tuesday, we have a new beginning of jumping into things unknown, taking that leap of faith, have faith in yourself. It's not worrying about where you're going to land, how you're going to land, what you're going to do after it. It's the jump itself. So on Monday, we had a lot of growth. It could be that you're getting ready to get courage up, inner courage or inner resources or outer resources to have a new beginning, and then you just jump into it. Very positive. Now on Wednesday, oh, that's even good. That's a good one too. We've got the Wheel of Fortune, which is changes. And you have to remember any change that happens in your life is usually by your own hand. You're the one that does it. So the Wheel of Fortune is a card of good luck, changes for the better. It could also mean changes for the worst. However, you're the one that decides which way to spin this wheel. Are you going to spin it forward and have more new things come in or changes for the better? Or are you going to go backwards? I have a feeling this is going forwards because we've got the prosperity and growth card here on Monday. Now for Thursday, now, oh, this is now, what I just got hit in the head with was this. If anyone is out there trying to have a child or trying to get pregnant, this is a definite yes. Because on Monday we have motherhood, we have a new beginning, and we have egg as in ovum. We have changes for the better, and then we have a child. So this is a pregnancy, definitely. On the mental emotional level, this is not beating yourself up. So control that beast within with love and then you'll have more growth. So this is something that's presented in your life that you need to not be so harsh with yourself. Don't judge yourself too harshly and gain that inner strength in order to move forward. So far, so good. It's a good week. I hope it hope it I hope that it uh, reflects my week because I need a good week, except not the pregnancy. Yay, even better. We've got the chariot now. This is a card of victory, a card of moving forward, trips, travels, and automobiles. It's also a choice of honor, giving up one thing you love for something else you love. So on Monday, we have growth and prosperity on all levels. That could be money. It could be physically, like at a child. It could be emotionally, coming to a new place in your mind. It could also be here, getting into the unknown, getting into the uh, new beginning, taking that leap that leap of faith and having faith in yourself to say, you know what, I'm going to start this project. I'm going to make myself a better person. Uh, on Wednesday, we have a good luck card, and that's changes for the better. Then on Thursday, we have not beating yourself up. And then on Friday, we have moving forward, victory card. So on the physical level, it could be a pregnancy that comes to pass if you're trying to have a child. It could be a trip that you're looking at. It could be buying a car. It could also be not beating yourself up emotionally and coming to a different place in your mind and moving forward as far as career, as far as mental health, well-being. It's very, very positive. I hope I get these energies this week because it's a good one. So to recap on this, I'm going to go over the, the physical level the mental, emotional level, and the spiritual level for the week. So on the physical level, we've got motherhood. We've got someone trying to have a child or maybe uh, changing the way that they mother a child that they already have. There's a brand new beginning here the next day of taking that leap, that leap of faith, that having faith in themselves to do this. And then on Wednesday, we have a good luck card and things changing for the better. Then we have a child, so if you're trying to get pregnant, well, you are. It's also a card of not beating yourself up. Like say you have a child, maybe you make a mistake. We all make mistakes. Don't beat yourself up because, you know, kids, they kind of bounce back. They really do. They're not as 
They're not as fragile as you think they are. And not everything you do as a mother is going to ruin your child. So this is not beating yourself up as far as children go. And then it's also a child itself on the physical level. And then moving forward and having a victory over this issue that has to do with children. So that's on the physical level. On the mental, emotional level, we've got you want to change yourself and you want to grow here on Monday. And you're feeling pretty good about yourself because you made a change already in the past. Otherwise, you wouldn't have this positive card here. Then you're saying, okay, I want to take this leap into territory that I've never been before. I'm going to take the chance on myself. I'm going to take that leap. Maybe have a different way of thinking. Maybe try to change your attitude. I know with me, trying not to be so negative sometimes. And then things change for the better. You're going to take that chance and change things for yourself on the mental, emotional level with this Wheel of Fortune, which is a good luck card. Then you're not going to beat yourself up. In other words, you're going to stop being your own worst enemy, which a lot of us do that because we're human. And then on Friday, we have a victory card and moving forward. So that's on the mental, emotional level. On the spiritual level, we've got on Monday here a lot of growth and prosperity, of course. And this is also the Holy Mother. So it's, it's also the goddess Venus, the goddess of love and, and empathy and things like that. And then on Tuesday, we're again taking that leap. On Wednesday, we're changing things for the better spiritually, internally. And on Thursday, we are not uh, taming that beast within with hate or, or with, with, with a hammer. We're saying, okay, I messed up. I'm going to be all right. I'm going to try something different. I'm not, gonna, I'm not going to try to squash any negative issues within myself, even spiritually. And I'm going to be a little more kinder with myself. And then on Friday is a victory card in moving forward. And spiritually, this is a card of a choice of honor. You're giving up one thing you love for something else you love. A lot of times, uh, say spiritually you want to change something. You want to raise your vibration or you want to feel not so stuck in that human kind of thing. You want to balance out a little more. Well, you're giving up that, that knee-jerk reaction, that, that stuck in the human physical thing. And you're taking the chance. And you know what? You are making a choice of honor because you're giving up something you love or something you used to. And now you're flipping over into something else you love, but you're reaching towards it. So you're giving that up on one side and you're taking something positive on this side. In either case, on any level, physical, mental, emotional, or spiritual, this is a victory. So it's very positive no matter what level you look at this. So I hope that you can apply this to your life in some way, whether it's on the physical level, whether it's on the mental emotional level, or whether it's on the spiritual level. Now, one more thing on the physical level, if you're looking for a trip or planning a trip, this is also about a trip. So if anybody out there is planning for a trip and maybe there was a little glitch here on Thursday, well, on Friday, it looks like everything is just fine. So enjoy yourself on the trip if anyone out there is planning one. So I hope that this has helped you in some way uh, for this week. Very good week. So thank you very much. And if you have any questions, you can give me a call here at the Labyrinth, Monday through Saturday, 939-2769. Please also leave a comment, a thumbs up, and also check out the other videos. There's a lot of other videos up there. Thank you and have a great week. It looks like you guys are going to have a great week. I hope I have a great week too. Thank you very much.